you guys. I only disagreed with him because it's Phil Kearns. I know. It's, it's, it's ingrained in my DNA. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what the refs are doing right. Richie was in the bin. Yeah! Because the World Cup <laughs> comes around only once every four years, our bosses gave us a solid chunk of change to work with. We've already burnt the majority on uh, catering, but saved just enough to outdo Channel 7's Mega Wall. Folks, I give you the Mega Mega Wall, where we can keep an eye on every live cup Fucking site man. around the planet. That's all looking good. Look at Wales, they're happy with the win this morning. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, it's really heating up there in Italy too. Someone's about to get the head taken off. Um, all right, over there in Uruguay, Stephen Hoyles, our rookie Fox Sports rugby performer. Good morning, everyone. You're How are you? Hello, uh, well, Buenos Dias, uh, Senor Hoyles. You're in Uruguay. Uh, what? Where are you? What's happening? Well, firstly, you said I was going to cover the World Cup in London. <laughs> Why am I in Montevideo with Jorge and? Diego down here, it's a disaster. I told you, we burn all the money on catering in the budget. Uh, tell us the vibe there, where exactly are you? Well, I'm trying to get the game on, but apparently it's not shown in any TV or pub in this country, so I'm at the, the home of Mario Sagario, the Uruguayan tight end, I'm at his, at his father's farm. Um, it's a bit of a tough environment. I've just been weed on by a duck, so that's interesting. <laughs> yeah. Righto, uh, Hoyles, you're going to have to get your own way home too, mate. As mentioned, we've got no cash to get the return leg in. So are you sweet? Well, well not really, mate. To be honest, I'd, I'd be lying <laughs> if I said I was sweet. It's a very relaxed country. They've just legalised marijuana, so I might be sweet in about an hour. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Hoyles, we'll say goodbye to you. We'll park you there. Now we're off to Villa Park where Greg Martin is standing by. Marto, we've earmarked this as the Wallabies' toughest test in Pool A, is there a similar feeling at the ground? Are the Aussie fans nervous? Mate, they... But I tell you what, the Uruguayan fans saw the Wallabies struggle a little bit, especially didn't get a bonus point, and they're thinking there's an upset, don't you? <laughs> no, nah, the reality is... OK, that's enough. The reality is that they are they think there's an upset. No, there's a party atmosphere here. The sun's shining and the Australians are here and they're thirsty and it's a lunchtime game and they're going off. How are we? Are we going to see... The thought is we're going to see a lot of tries today. This is about entertainment today's game. It ain't going to be a grind that we're going to see later in the tournament. This is about fun, fun, fun. We've even got the cops. Are you expecting much, many problems today? Good day. No problems today. Everyone happy. How good are the cops over here? They're encouraging everyone to enjoy it. That's what today's about because next Saturday, that's when the whips are really going to start cracking. So for today, we're all going to have fun.